You guys seem to enjoy the last episode of Ranked with Daniel, so I'm releasing the second half with the last three games of our rank session. Also, I did figure out the freezing issue on Steam, so it looks like I'm finally able to record again on Steam. Ah, home sweet home. I hope you guys enjoy the commentary and gameplay as always, but now let's get into the matches. Alright, Hesse and Eris. 1765 and... 2080. I didn't know Hesse was so low. That's not even SSL, but he's a good player. I right, got some space for Dan here again. Over the one. Hesse's. Uh, Eris gonna probably clear this or try to control. Either way, I can't go for the backward play, so I'm just gonna wait. Over Eris, seeing if Hesse wants to turn on this. That works. Over the one. Yeah, I've, I'm pretty low here. I don't really want to push in the mid midfield. It's not really too scary if he's going off target like that. I'm just trying to make sure he doesn't uh, take it onto onto net. 50-50 across. They're holding good pressure, but they're not really doing anything with it. So I'm not too scared of that. Nice. Good follow-up. Got the space. Saw Dan trying to pop it downfield. I was kind of scared of when Hesse was going to challenge, but I had confidence to go for it. It's kind of 95% of this game is just confidence. Like, this should come to us after this. Hesse's back backwards. Could be good. Good shot to the top left. I missed the boost because I was watching the shot, which is kind of stupid. I should <laughs> be focusing on my play here. Really early uh, aggression from Eris, but got a good challenge. He's going to get my boost because of that, too. He might try to flick that, yeah. It's totally fine. I didn't expect Dan to go for that. It's my bad. It's too really bad. Yeah, good follow-up. I was zero that whole time, so I was just trying to keep it really close. I think my, my mistake was that flip right there. I could have just stayed with it in case he went for the challenge, which he did. Popped it around me. Dan was also looking for boost, too. Got the demo here. I can't go for this mid boost without the ball because, yeah, like I said, that guy's gonna be right there, so it's also okay. I think there was space because I don't think Eris is gonna go on that. Nice. Dan's gonna go for the boost. That's all right. That's actually really good for us. I think Dan thought that I needed boost. Over him. Good fake by Dan. Oh, that mid boost just spawned too, and I didn't look at it. He's gonna beat me. To th beat me to this. I want that 50-50 because it's gonna put them in a lot of pressure on their back end. All right, as long as one of us get that, Aeris should be low. Oh, big fakes! I think. Uh, I think Hesse was zero there, or whoever that was on the floor. It's a really good play from uh, Dan. It's almost 2-2-2 two, two, two across the board. Yeah, it was Hesse in midfield here. He had zero. I'm going to go for a need boost play here. Go back right corner. I wasn't sure if he was going to try and follow that. Should be alright. Like, sometimes it's okay to lose a ball in the back corner because... Uh... It's just going to go to your teammate anyway. I'm going to fake this and then stay with the ball. Make sure I at least get a 50-50 before I bail for boost. Nice 50-50. I'm going to follow this. Get a touch around him. Okay, that's not the best touch, but I do put pop up the wall. See, Dan wants to go up for this. I'm going to keep it to save for the corner. Hopefully, he can get that boost before they go for it. Oh! <laughs> I did a fake fake flip forward there to try and uh, give myself some space. End up touching the ball the way that I didn't really want to, but it was the right idea. I was... Oh, I spawned. There we go. He's in 50-50. Should be Dan's here. I was hoping that he would be a little closer. I think he backed off in case the 50-50 went worse, which is 
not the the worst thing to do i fake this i've been going for those early aggressive uh, aggressive nice aggressive challenges quite often in this game i didn't want to keep doing that because they probably expected it i backed off instead off the backboard Ooh. Did we good? Doink? No, I can't. I couldn't do it. Nice pop. Ow. Should be okay though. I didn't want didn't overcommit at all. A midfield pass here. I like that he didn't go for it. He saw that I was being bumped. Ooh. Good touch from Dan. Lots of space. The back left corner. We got him trying to bump Eris here. He actually flipped into the net. Don't need to be over aggressive. We got uh, 10 seconds left. Oh, he actually got a really good follow up there. That's a really nice shot. I tried to I tried to follow it up without uh, flipping. I knew that he was going to try and go for an air dribble of sorts, but that was a really good follow-up. I mean, there's not really much I could do there. I tried to jump a little bit higher than I expected, but he still went even higher. Oh, good try. If Dan got that freely, I think if the other guy wasn't challenging, he would have been a lot more confident to just go for the shot there. It was definitely open. I'll let him go for this. Ooh, big fakes. Be a little dangerous. I gotta be playing a uh, some solid defense here. Oh, that's not good. Uh oh, good play. This could be really bad though. I think Eris made a mid touch, mi miss touch. Definitely did not play that well, though. Should we okay? Try to go for that snipe. It was close. Nice challenge. I can't quite go for this. I'm going to leave, leave the boost for Dan. I'm going to fake this. save early shot space for Dan now though what a shot is that in oh my god he's the best <laughs> oh my goodness that was a bit panicky I mean with comms it definitely would have been a lot easier but wow it's just like that solo play Dan's the man man he's, he's so good I mean I'm streaming these live we haven't lost I just don't I don't know what to say he's he's so consistent Got them again. They're actually a pretty solid squad. Pretty close game. Should be alright. Watch out for the bumps here. Try to buff Aeris. This is really bad because he got a solo play on, on Dan here. And I try I just should not have free jumped that because it was such a tight angle. The only shot he could really make is on the right side of the net. Or I guess the left side if you're looking in, but. Definitely could have played that a lot better. My first touch wasn't great either. Good follow up. He didn't have his boost stolen, so I'm just gonna back off with him here. Nice. Expected Dan to get that read. Nice shot to the top bar as well. Really bad clear from Hesse there to try and pop it uh, behind Dan. I actually thought Dan was gonna shoot that on target, but he was try I think he was trying to, because he would have beat them, obviously. But it actually still works out. I'm not gonna go for this yet, because I'm waiting for Hesse's touch. Round one, actually bumped the other one too. Should be okay. I don't think Dan got that boost, I'm not sure. Yeah, I didn't think so. He still got the read. That's incredible. <laughs> I had to go for that early. There's nothing I could really do on the back end to try and save that. So I just went for the ball as soon as possible. It's a little scary, but 
It works out. Behind Eris. He read that super early. Play though. The boost isn't there for Dan, so unfortunately he's probably just waiting for it. Yeah, there he goes. I was thinking of going for a backflip, but it'll slow my momentum down. It actually probably wouldn't be good. They were ready for it. So I'm going to watch out for bumps here as last man because it has to be in front. Eris actually gets a free shot there. It's a little dangerous. I think Dan will go for this. Yeah, I'm going to take their corner while I'm here. What's well, a good play, actually. Pop that up super early. Good play from Dan to keep, keep it close. Nice. I had to be ready just in case they pop it around him. Can't quite go for this yet. A little awkward, but he should be okay. Good touch to the corner. I think he got that corner boost. He's probably at like 60 right now. Not my greatest touch because I, I thought he was actually closer and then I panicked when I saw he was actually further away and I was wasting the ball, but to be okay. Almost got the read. If he actually, if, if, if Hesse committed to that, uh, it wouldn't really good for us. Help him a little bit. The boost. Hopefully, we can get a bump on him. Close. Also close. We're holding that pressure. I shot the backboard. Probably a follow up. Nice. Gotta be a little careful though. Okay, first pop. Behind to Eris. Eris' play. <laughs> that was interesting. Good control from Dan. Good shot. Oh, he still read it. <laughs> that was such a dumb play. I knew it was going to work, though, for some reason. I just had a feeling. Like, the second that Eris got beat, I just sat there with the ball. Waiting for it to go across to the crossbar. But it's still pretty funny. There's a lot of game time down down in the uh, down in the match already. I think he missed. Yeah, he did. He missed as well. Maybe a double, tight double. Oh, this is gonna be dangerous. Nice, good coverage by Dan. We a shot too. It's gonna be a little dangerous though. Got it now. I'm gonna avoid the demos here. Good challenge from Dan. I'm gonna go for the back corner now. I think Dan's probably gonna be pretty low here though, so only one of us has boost. Hesse is having a heyday on the backboard. Should be alright. We actually went super early there. Play from Dan. Close. Got a fl flip reset wave dash, but don't want to fully overcommit because it's kind of dangerous, especially with the low time. Oh, that's bad. That is really bad. I definitely played that wrong. I was scared of the bump from the other guy. Like right here, he was jumping at me and I went, went to the right when I didn't really want to. It was good of him to try and bump me, but I didn't play that approach very well. I'll leave it down. No need to go for that. Oh, nearly an open shot. Off the backboard. I should not have rolled that. I probably could have scored. Good pace from Dan. I'm going to be very low boost here, though. Oh, sorry. I don't need to say sorry. I was just trying to get out of his way. Let him go for that while I get the corner boost. Cause some pressure. 
Try to bump him on it as well. Ooh. Don't want to go for this yet. Hesse's going to be up very early. Off the backboard. Probably could have challenged a little bit earlier than that, but it's still pretty dangerous. Good save from Eris. What a touch. I'm going to leave that boost for Dan here. Somehow I didn't get the flip reset though, unfortunately, so it's going to be a little dangerous. Good pop from Dan. What a touch. I am dead. Hopefully Dan can get that. Nice follow-up. Oh, I have no boost. Let him know. Take this boost from them. They just wasted a lot. Nice double 50-50. I know Hesse's very, very low. I'm just going to grab the boost. So, all right. Off the corner. Doesn't have that. Nice 50 50 from Dan. Good for Hesse here. Back pass, I guess. Didn't mean to do that, but it works. Watching for the bumps here. That's off. Close, though. It's actually good that he didn't demo me. I think it would have been really bad if, if he did demo. It might actually be just be open. <laughs> and there he does it again, man. It's just every time Dan figures out a way to do it. That's five games, five wins. We're at 2085 now. My goodness. Some pretty tough 1v2 situations that I was in in that game. I definitely didn't play all of them right. Obviously, they scored right there on that first goal. And uh, earlier on, the the one bump play attempt. And then I got in a weird position. But we both played the uh, the 1v2s pretty well. They, they, are, they are definitely the most aggressive team we've played in these games. Um, but we still got the wins. We got 10 shots. <laughs> my, uh, my shot accuracy... I mean, I'm causing a lot of pressure. Let's just say that, but a little bit of copium. Oh, we got Astromic and Ajax again after a couple cues with Hesse and uh, Eris. I'm going to go for this. That's my bad. Should be okay, though, actually. Like I said, a lot of situations where the ball comes out like that. No way he goes for that. Oh, my. Of course he does. What am I saying? It's the 150 ping. <laughs> I was like, there's no way he goes for that. I'm going to clear it to the corner because... He would know that I would do that, right? Nope. No, he went. Quick snipe back. We'll take We'll take it. I made up for it. Definitely did not think he would challenge me there when I have him beat. 100%. Like, I'm right there with the ball, but he decided to go. But we will, uh, we'll make, we'll make do. Big misses from Astromic. Can't quite follow it. Nice. They can pop it around the net. Good play for the boost as well. Nice flick to the side. Get the boost from Ajax here. Try to... Zone him out if I can. What the heck is going on in this game? <laughs> Alright, Dan didn't get the back corner, so I'm just going to grab this. I read that early ch uh, chop from him. Kind of knew that he was going to... I'm just going to play the over-aggression. Uh, aggression. I keep saying aggressive for some reason. I'm playing into that early aggression that they're doing by doing the exact same thing back to them. So I'm just going to uh, play that uh, that role. It's totally fine. Ooh, this could work. Once again, I'm not fully committing there. 
He's super scared of me challenging him. Should be okay. Dan should have that now. Nice 50 50. Back corners up. Should be a finish. Nice. I was trying to keep that close to Dan to hopefully shoot. It wasn't the best shot for me. I probably could have shot that a lot stronger, but I was definitely worried about a bump or something. I'm not, I can't even remember what I was worried about. I just remember there being some sort of issue. Got the boost. That was decent. Kind of bad though, because a strong mix there, but yeah, it's in. <laughs> I made a good flick and I was hoping that that back pass would go to Dan, but of course the strong mix right there and he turns right away. I think Dan was trying to wait for the ball to come to him. He probably could have beat him if he went, but that was uh, not my best play though. Nice flick. Bottom right corner. Perfect. He ended up think uh, thinking that I was going to shoot that super early, so he just flew past the ball. Read the uh, post bounce, and we get a goal. I'm going to get my boost stolen here, so I don't want to waste any more. Nice save from Dan. Nice. I'm on the right here if he wants to pass it. Ends up uh, knocking it back to the... Uh, the other team. By that I mean Ajax, like he was passing it back. I can't follow that up. Hopefully Dan's on the backboard, he is. To pop over over me there from Astromic. Very low, so I'm just going on the backboard in case in case Dan wasn't, which he was. 50-50. Oh, I'm glad I didn't bump Dan there. That's tough. Make sure I do a strong shot. Once the strongest sees that uh, Ajax has control, he went for the back corner boost. I kind of expected that. This could be dangerous. Nice double though. I'm gonna avoid the bumps here. I'm just making them panic by go up to that going up to that ball. Good shot. Both of them go up. That's not what I meant to do. I, I meant to... <laughs> Wait, Dan's up there. <laughs> what the heck? No problem. He's in 50-50. Tommy's there for the catch. Good, ca good cancel by Dan there. Good bump as well from me. Good try. I wasn't in the best position to pass that up to Dan when he was sitting there on the backboard, so I didn't want to I didn't want to try and force the issue. So I tried to play it safe and I made a I kinda let go of the ball by accident. What is happening? Good fake from Dan, you should get the boost. Grab this boost from a, a stromach, it's really important. Get the pressure. No way. Can't go for this still. A lot of stromach to try and take the ball, but End up faking them and we get another win at 6-0 in games. <laughs> what is actually happening? We're climbing to 2100 again in a matter of like an hour. Oh, never mind. He's got scrims. That might be a two videos because I don't. I, I feel like there was a lot of good information in there. I don't want to cut a lot of that. I feel like Dan played super, super well too. So he's probably really warmed up for scrims now. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the two episodes. If I do make it two episodes, I have no idea yet. We'll figure it out. Um, but you'll, you'll know <laughs> if it is. Until next time, have a great day, guys. I'll catch you guys in the next one.